not stealing. My God will bless you. Once up in the day, the day is rolling. My God will bless you. And a big big guy, and a big guy. It's God how much that have money, that have water. No human being on earth. There is only one power, and then there is only one God. Jehovah, the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords. Any other God you know, it does not concern me. Ekel Olweke. My names are uh, Prophet. I'm about to tell the whole world who is really Prophet Jeremiah Omotofufui of Christ Messiland, Warish City. Share this broadcast to your group. Let me educate my name again. My names are Prophet Onye Wama Okocha Onyeze Jesus. Jeremiah Omotofufui is part of Onyeze Jesus. Onyeze Jesus is part of senior prophet Jeremiah Motofufui. Believe that. The earlier you understand it, the better for you. You are welcome to the End Time Truth Television, the channel for the lovers of truth, for the truth of the end time. So if you are a lover of truth, Give us a subscription and God bless you. Shalom. Hello everybody. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. God bless you today, tomorrow. And always I want to say thank you very much to my wonderful viewers and uh, returning viewers. God bless you if you are a subscriber. Thank you so much. And if you are just seeing our channel for the very first time, I want to plead with you to Give us your subscription and don't forget to share the video and give us a thumbs up if you like this video. Uh, there is this video that uh, seemed to have taken everybody by surprise, but I really don't understand why people are, you know, surprised that Onyeze Jesus is linking himself with Jeremiah Omoto Fufenye. That has not been a new thing. It is not something that started today. Uh, I started seeing Onyeze Jesus, I think, as far back as 2001 or late 2020. In all the videos that he did that time, there are three men he would always give um, recognition in all the videos that he was doing in the water side. He would appreciate Jeremiah Moto Fufenyi, he would appreciate Johnson Suleiman and the Reverend Father Eji Kembaka. You know, I chose not to pay attention to it because... Um, for some reasons, I really don't know why, but I, I think, I guess I know why. Uh, but let me just keep it and hold it to myself because I know some of you here who are very, very fanatic will uh, want to take exception to what I'm saying. But then it is my opinion and your opinion too shouldn't be a problem to me. And so what I'm saying is that it is not something that has just happened today. You know, if you take a look at this video here now, you would see, see him paying obeisance to this man and giving them recognition. But I do not support any evil. I'm here to work. You that is speaking against me. The money you are wasting in a club is more than this 50 naira I'm wearing here. Even more can I, man. I'm not wasting money. Neither. I'm helping people to get money from God, not from Satan. If they get money, they will help, they will help their, their government. We are helping government. Because if you raise the Bironi, I will raise their own community. So I bless your city in the mighty name of Jesus. All the prophets that I respect so much in the world, Apostle Justin Suleiman, Prophet Jeremiah, all my brothers in the Christendom, I greet you. Eleven for the age came back. Who are you? Nakebu. I come with the name. Who no name? I greet all of you. It shall be well with all of you. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Yeah. What surprised me, or what surprises me till tomorrow, is that none of them has actually come out to dissociate themselves from whatever they see the man is doing. Now, you know, it is very, very um, open. It is an open secret that Onyeze Jesus is a mammed servant. And when he is giving credence, or what is it called now, appreciation and thumbs up to this man, and they have not come out openly to dissociate themselves from him. And they will not tell me that none of their followers have really seen this man 
called their names while he is doing what he is doing. I wouldn't say he was because, in fact, he has diversified. He has he has gone, um, you know, into other means and, and systems of carrying out his nefarious activities. And now, you know, because he is unintelligent, just like the man he recently came out to endorse. And so I really don't know the hula baloo about all these things. But in case you don't know who Onye the Jesus is, just take a look at some of these videos. I'm December. <laughs> I'm just doing this in order to relate to you the video of his trying to endorse Jeremiah Omoto Fufenyi. And unfortunately, he came out also to defend Jeremiah. I don't know what is wrong with him because I really don't think, uh, or should I say that maybe he thinks he is, he is um, an honorable person. Um, the only good thing about him is that he is not hiding his his wickedness. He's not hiding his uh, practice, just like others would hide their, theirs. But the pain about it is that he is doing it in the name of Jesus. And I'm going to do part two of this video, and then we're going to look at some of the things that he has been doing. I've done uh, videos about him at least twice or so. But this one is just for me to make reference to this endorsement and his defense of Jeremiah Omoto Fufeni. So if anybody is offended at what I'm saying, and you are a follower of Jeremiah Omoto Fufenyi or Johnson Suleiman or even Eji Kembaka, please, I want you to re uh, redirect your anger, your angst, and your frustration to those people you are following because if they don't have anything to do with this man, they should have come out openly to address this thing and to deny him, denounce him openly, but I've not seen anywhere that they said, I don't know this man and warn him not to mention them in their videos. None of those has been said, and so the endorsement stands. So I'd like you to watch the video in case you have not watched it before. Here we are. And this will go a long way to a kind of buttress more on the person of Jeremiah Omoto Fufeni. I'll be seeing you in the next video as I allow you to watch this video. God bless you till I come your way again in the next video. From me to you, Shalom. Let me tell you my encounter with Prophet Jeremiah Omotofufuyi. I will tell you my encounter with Prophet Jeremiah Omotofufuyi. People don't know who is Prophet Jeremiah Omotofufuyi. In the year 2013, when things started turning upside down in my life. When everybody forsake me, even my blood brother, everybody forsake me. Nowhere to run, nobody to help. Year 2013, I'm going from one church to another, from one church to another. I have attended so many crusades. No one. 2013, 2014, 2015, 2016, 2017, 2018, 2019. I have an encounter with God of Prophet Jeremiah Motofufui. This thing I'm telling you here now 
is part of my encounter with Prophet Jeremiah Motofufui. Until I have an encounter with Senior Prophet Jeremiah Omota, I haven't told you about this story before. But I want to use this opportunity to tell you this story because of what is going on in social media today. Many people are speaking evil against that man. Many people are talking nonsense about that man. You don't know Prophet Jeremiah very well. I think you don't know that man very well. That man is a God sent in this generation to deliver mankind from captivity. I met an encounter with Senior Prophet Jeremiah on September 2019. I have nothing. I, ha I was nobody. I was nobody then. That was uh, when he's doing uh, his first uh, surrounding water program. Surrounding water program. That was the first time he hosted that program, surrounding water. I was opportune to meet with him. Since that day, my life changed. Since that day, after I came back to my base, God now showed me where to follow, how to move, where to follow. Prophet Jeremiah Motofufui is a good man, whether you like it or not. If you like, you give up. I know I don't even, uh, before you hurt me, self, you, you ask yourself whether you are important to me. Are you turning your name or David or ADBC? That is their own concern. Before you say you hurt me or you disrespect me, are you important to me before? Are you understand? Is man God send to liberate mankind? It's true. I, I know that I'm, I'm not used to talking about him here. I just keep silence. 2019, God used Senior Prophet Jeremiah Motofufui to make a spiritual door for me, to make a way in my life. 2019 is, my, is the year I encountered the God of Mercy City, in, in uh, uh, which I can never forget it in my life. That is the first time Prophet Jeremiah hosted surrounding water program. That surrounding water, September 2019, my picture is there. The video of me is there as an evidence. Why are you speaking evil against that man? Why are you people castigating a man that has done nothing to you people? Why are you people want to bring down a man God has brought to wipe away our tears? Why are people don't like good things in life? No one is perfect. No one is above mistake. Why are you providing a man with a good heart? A man with a golden heart. If everybody deny him, I will not deny him. Prophet Jeremiah is part of me. And I, when you say Jesus, is part of Jeremiah. I'm not hiding. Prophet Jeremiah Motavufui is part of when you say Jesus. And when you say Jesus is part of Prophet Jeremiah, no doubt about that. Whether you believe it or not, whether you believe it or not, if you like, call him fake pastor. You are the, you are the original. Carry your original the Wakana. 
God used Prophet Jeremiah to teach me spiritual things, to deliver me in the hands of my enemies. Prophet Jeremiah is a good man. He's a man of spiritual. He's a man of spiritual. Through Prophet Jeremiah, I have known so many spiritual things today. Through Prophet Jeremiah Motovufi, I have come to understand so many spiritual things today. You are hurtness. You are hurt against him. Will not make me to stop speaking good of a man that God used to show me spiritual things. Prophet Jeremiah is a one in a million. Whether you like it or not, Prophet Jeremiah Omotovufi is one of spiritual man God sent. People talking about Jeremiah Omotovufi, be careful. You speaking evil against that man, be careful. Jeremiah Omotovufi is a real man. He's a good man. Is too dangerous spiritually. Physically, he's bigger. Final word. Jeremiah Motofufui is part of Onyeze Jesus. Onyeze Jesus is part of Senior Prophet Jeremiah Motofufui. Believe that. The earlier you understand it, the better for you.